everybody, Johnny here doing another Tone demo. Um, I've got the Ulbrich 12X today. It's one of my all-time favorite pedals. This one I've had for ages. Um, I think I got it probably about six years ago. Uh, it's been gigged, it's, it's been beaten up. It's pretty much looked like this since I got it. Um, you know, someone's got their, their little dots on it for tone marks and stuff. Um, now, as far as I know, this is just a standard 12 ax um, but this one was actually made for Jimmy Barnes. Um, I know that because I, I got it serviced by Dave Albrick himself, um, and he, uh, yeah, he told me that, uh, yeah, he made this one for Jimmy Barnes. So I got it second hand, and uh, that's that's what it, <laughs> that's what happened. Um, yeah, so obviously it's got the, the back panel and stuff, and, and um, obviously the serial number's written there, and uh, there was a new switch put in it in 2007. That wasn't by me. Anyways, that's just a bit of history on this specific pedal. Um, he's been making the 12-ax the same way since day one. Um, since the, uh, I think they came out in the late 80s, early 90s. Oh, well, the first edition did. Um, and anyway, it's, it's, uh, it's such a good pedal because it's just so dynamic, and... Uh, not just from how hard you play or how you know your pick attack or whatever, but by how many strings you uh, you strum as well. Now, by that, what I mean is obviously when you add overdrive, you're adding a you know a certain clipping stage to specific harmonics in your signal. Um, so you got your your your, your uh, clean signal, which would be here, and then once you add something like an overdrive pedal, you get these layers on top and layers underneath, and so they're called. Um, even order and uneven order harmonics. Uh, there are a lot more uh, uneven order harmonics in distortion pedals, uh, but there's and then there's a lot more even harmonics in a overdrive pedal. Uh, so in this first clip, you'll hear um, the everything at twelve o'clock on the pedal, and uh, you'll hear how it changes uh, and how it works dynamically um, from when I strum a full chord into you know, some two note chords or some uh, single note, single note lines. Right, here we go. In this next clip, uh, I'm going to use the marks that uh, have been put on the pedal. So it's boosting the volume, dropping the gain a little bit, and the tone is almost all the way off. It's probably on about 20%. Uh, I am doing things a bit differently today too. I'm using my Arena 50 instead of the Club 20, um, just because I felt like it. And it is going through the Ulbrich um, 212 cab, which is closed back, offset, and loaded with V30s. clip is something that I really love about this pedal is that um, you can really push the amp even a 50 watt single channel head like this with set really really clean um, you know just boosting that volume is uh, helps to push the amp um, into a bit more of like a punchy mid-range kind of like a power amp kind of overdrive power amp gain feel um, it's, that's hard to portray in a video, um, obviously, but uh, when uh, when you boost the volume with this pedal, you can feel that um, you're getting more push and more like mid-range and more like growl kind of out of it. Um, so in this next clip, you'll um, you'll hear how you'll hear how the harmonics kind of 
do their thing and differ and, and jump around a bit. Um, I'm going to play a little ninth chord thing um, and, uh, you know, using that, using those notes in a, in a ninth chord um, and uh, you'll hear how the pedal reacts to that and how with a Strat and a clean amp, you can still get some pretty heavy tones. <laughs> Last clip coming up, and you know, to be honest, I'm sure everyone knows this pedal, or, or in some way, shape, or form. It's it's been around for ages, and it's you know, it's a it's a staple for me. Uh, look, at the moment, it's not actually on my board, but every time I plug into it, I just no, yeah, loving that sound. So I'm just going to have a bit of fun on this last this last clip, and um, instead of doing a Stevie jam, I'm going to do a bit of a John Mayer jam. Um, yeah, so um, the pedal for the rhythm track the uh the pedal is on I've just rolled the volume back on the guitar uh and then um for the lead stuff the pedals are stalled at 12 o'clock and the different tones are coming from my fingers and 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 playing differently um dynamically so enjoy <laughs> checking out my demo of the Ulbrich 12 x I hope this video was informative. Please hit subscribe. Uh, any comments, please leave them in the, in the comment section and uh, I'll get back to them. Have a great day.